welcome back to the weekly pause. This week we'll be diving into a topic that is very familiar, the good, the bad, and ugly of stress. Let's take a minute to hear from our community ambassadors as they share with us the tools they use to manage stress. My go-to tools for stress, obviously breath, which I think everybody knows, but it truly does work to allow yourself to stop, take a few deep breaths, put yourself in the present moment, feel your feet on the ground, and be able to really calm your nervous system and put things in perspective. And then another tool that is key for me is getting out, moving my body, getting my heart rate up, being out in nature. So when I'm feeling that I just have a lot of stress happening in my life and I can feel that, number one, it's the awareness, of course, of, oh, I'm feeling that stress response, I'm feeling some anxiety. Not that I can necessarily stop it or attempt to control it, but just being aware of it and then knowing that if I can get outside, if I can go for a run, if I can go for a hike, if I can get on my bike, if I can look around me at the vast beauty amongst us and we're so lucky because we live in such a beautiful place and that just brings perspective as well as gets the you know the adrenaline going and that release that I need so much and it doesn't have to be long 15 20 minutes and it's better it's better I was asked to talk about how we deal with stress. I have a dangerous job, I have three children, I live in the Vale Valley. We all know that that's stressful in itself. First thing I do is, and this sounds silly, but I take a deep breath. In through my nose with the good, out with the mouth with my bad. Uh, that really helps me in the moment. Um, the next thing I think about is how bad is it really? Uh, think about how bad it could be and how bad is it really? It's probably not that bad and that helps me out. Putting myself around really good people with positive attitudes and staying away from the negative people that we all know, um, that that helps. Calling a friend that that will put you in a good place, that knows your situation helps. Um, and taking care of yourself, making sure you're doing me time. We're all parents, we always think that's the most important thing, but really taking care of me. Going out fly fishing, that, that puts me in a different place and when I'm in that place, I usually come up with a better idea than if I'm sitting there stressing about it. So taking care of me matters. Thanks, Amy and Brian, for sharing your go-to stress tools. I personally know a thing or two about deep breaths, but hey, they work. Uh, thanks again for listening and for subscribing to The Weekly Pause. See you next week.